What is the difference between static binding and dynamic binding? In case of static binding, the type of the object is determined only during your compile time. Whereas in dynamic binding, the type of the object is determined during the run time. If you see over here, this example is for static binding. Here in our main, we are creating an object D1 of the type dog and we are invoking the method walk using the object D1. So D1.walk will invoke the method over here and the output will be dog is walking. And this is realized by the compiler that d1.walk will execute the statement during the compile time itself. Whereas in your dynamic binding, we have a base class and a derived class that is derived from the base class. So if you see, we have two methods for walk and two methods are having different output line. When we execute the void main, we are creating an object for the base class and assigning it to derived class initialization. So if you see, when I invoke the walk method using this object A, it will invoke the derived class method. So this is known as dynamic binding and it happens only during the runtime. The compiler will be able to know that this method is what it has to execute.